welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another weekly grocery haul and meal plan. This week I did go back to Walmart, so I did Walmart grocery pickup. As I say every week, if you haven't tried it, you can use my link down below and get $10 off and that helps me out because then I save $10. I was able to save $10 thanks to you guys today. So instead of my total being $170, my total was $160. I got quite a bit of stuff. We were like completely out of cheese and we love cheese so that was a problem. So we stocked up on the cheese that they had, got a lot of produce and yeah I'm going to show you guys the meal plan. I had to change it a little bit because I did have some substitutions. I only had two out of stocks. They were out of cinnamon raisin bagels which was an impulse purchase. I saw them and I was like ooh that sounds good but they didn't have them so. No cinnamon raisin bagels this week. I could probably make some because I think I have raisins. Maybe not bagels, but maybe like a cinnamon raisin bread. Hmm, maybe I'll do that. I don't know. Um, so they were out of that and one other thing. I cannot remember. Oh, they were out of refried beans, which seems odd because there's like six different kinds of refried beans. So they were completely out of refried beans. Seems a little bit odd, but whatever. We'll eat black beans or something instead. So go ahead and show you guys the meal plan and then we'll get into the haul. Okay, here is the meal plan. I'm going to keep showing it to you guys this way because I just feel like it's easier for me. I don't have to pull out my book. Um, I got some questions on this actual thing and I just googled weekly meal planner printable like free printable on Google and picked one from the images that I liked, printed it and then laminated it with my laminator and then I use a wet erase vis-a-vis -vis marker and yeah that's that's that. Um, I can't I couldn't find the exact one but if I can maybe I will try to link that image down below for you guys if you want it um so this is supposed to be tilapia Walmart was out of tilapia so I changed it to salmon broccoli and then mac and cheese pork carnitas bowls this will be the first time I'm trying to make pork carnitas and then we're gonna make like some rice and stuff and do like chipotle style bowls asiago garlic sausage and ravioli salads with chicken bacon and egg if I remember to make the egg this time beef enchiladas, sweet and sour chicken and fried rice, and meatball subs. And I'm actually going to make these sub rolls myself because I can't find sub rolls, sandwich rolls, whatever in the grocery store right now. I mean, I probably could if I went to Kroger, but with just doing grocery pickup, um, I haven't been able to find sub rolls. So I'm just gonna make them myself. But that is going to be our meal plan. And here is everything that we got. As I said, we got a lot of stuff. Spent $160. So over here, tons of cheese. Got a medium cheddar, two sharp cheddars. They were out of the big block, so that's why I got two of them. Got a big thing of mozzarella, thing of American cheese, some sliced cheddar to make Andy's breakfast sandwiches, string cheese, and then I was wanting blue cheese on our salads. And what is happening to my voice? <coughs> okay, we're better now. Got some cookie dough ice cream, two things of eggs. This was a substitution. I just ordered regular country sausage and they gave me sage. I have literally never bought that. Don't think I've ever tasted it. Uh, don't know what I'm gonna use it for. If you have any ideas, let me know down below because I have never bought this. From what I read, all like breakfast sausage like that has some sage in it. This just says extra sage and people apparently like it like, like around the holidays and they like stuffing or dressing. So is there anything else that you guys use this for? Let me know. Then we've got some bacon. I got the regular sliced hickory smoked bacon and then also the thick sliced one. Got some meatballs. We really liked these great value meatballs in the past when we had them. So I picked them up for our meatball subs just to be easy because um, making homemade meatballs can just be time consuming, especially when I'm going to be making the sub rolls myself. So we got these because we like these. The salmon. I had ordered the four pound bag of tilapia. They gave me two two pound bags of salmon, which salmon is more expensive than tilapia. So I came out ahead there got the salmon for the tilapia price duke's mayonnaise went ahead and picked up the gigantic one 48 ounces this is like right at five dollars <throat> got some enchilada sauce some large shell noodles i'm going to be making my dad's pasta salad um it's different than the one that i usually make it has tuna in it 
and mayonnaise, which is why I needed more mayonnaise, celery, and lots and lots of dill and cheese. That's another reason why we needed more cheese, because it has like cubed up cheddar cheese in it. I've been craving that for some reason, so I'm gonna make that. Got some wild berry pop tarts this week, some turkey breasts, and I actually ordered the big Walmart one and they were out. So we got Hillshire Farms again, Ritz Bits, Andy's grandmother sent the kids one of the little snack packs. And they're just, Ritz Bits are just so good. I just love those. Got some marinara sauce. This is our favorite one. That's the Walmart brand. Picked up a new dry shampoo because mine is almost out. Decided to try this Dove Care Volume and Fullness Dry Shampoo. Um, let me know down below what's your favorite dry shampoo. Uh, I use dry shampoo all the time but have never really found one that I super duper love. Currently I have the like Not Your Mother's one that comes in the, like the brown. This one is just gonna be white. They didn't have a brown one in stock. Um, so I just got that. Andy's car had a leak in the window and so there was like some mold and stuff in there. So we got this to help clean his car because we got that fixed. This was a substitution. I saw a new seasoning by Lowry's. It was the Lowry's Casero. I think I'm saying that right, probably not. But it was a total seasoning and I wanted to try it to see if it was comparable to the Body A Complete. Um, but apparently they didn't actually have it in stock and they gave me whole oregano instead. And I was gonna take it off, but the guy couldn't find what bag it was in. So I was like, you know what, just leave it. I can always use more oregano. It's only $1.50, so I just, took it and then we've got some long grain and wild rice some parchment paper I use that for Andy's breakfast sandwiches got some honey wheat bread ordered the Kroger they gave me Sarah Lee and then all of the produce we got carrots and broccoli and celery a massive onion this thing is huge some of these constellation tomatoes these are so good and they look good and then jalapenos for the pork carnitas. Um, it's really hard to order like one jalapeno because they're sold by the weight. And the smallest weight it would go was a quarter of a pound. So I ended up with five jalapenos. So don't know what I'm gonna do with all the jalapenos. We'll see. Got two cucumbers and these cucumbers look excellent. No mushy spots, no mushy ends. Like last week at Kroger, got some pico just because it's easy I could totally make it myself but this is good and easy got some potatoes some bananas two oranges for the pork carnitas a bag of gala apples limes some of these are for the pork carnitas but then I don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest we will see got a tomato cranberry raspberry juice this I think it was Carla McKenzie that I saw share this looks so good Mike's Hard Pineapple Mandarin Lemonade. Sounds amazing. I was surprised it was actually on the grocery pickup app. So when I saw it, I knew I had to get it. Of course, we got more ginger Sprite, some cola for Andy, and then this is for me, Dr. Pepper and Cream Soda. I have been looking for this on the app. And when I went into Kroger, Kroger didn't have it. And I looked on Kroger's app and Kroger didn't have it last week. So I've been looking for it because I know I'm going to love it. So I found that this week. So we got lots of soda and it's gonna take us forever to drink all that soda. We still have Ginger Sprite from last week. We got three things of milk. We were pretty much completely out of milk. And so we got three and they're out of 2%. So we got whole milk and then orange juice. We're out of orange juice. So we got two more half gallons of orange juice. But that is going to be it for our grocery haul this week. If you liked it, please make sure you leave us a thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. And as always, I thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.